Hey, what's going on, everybody? Hope we're doing great today. Happy Saturday. We got three matchups on this NBA slate today. Be sure to hit that subscribe button, guys. Definitely helps out. And check out all my betting links in the description below. Really great offer with BetMGM. Uh, bet 5, get 150 in bonus bets, guys. It's a great promo. Uh, other great promos with FanDuel, DraftKings, and Bet365. All those links are in the description, guys. If you want to get in on the action, go ahead and do that. That would be dope. And uh, yeah, we'll hop in it. Just three games today on this Saturday. Very light slate. Starting with the Orlando Magic versus the Detroit Pistons. Magic opening up as a 7.5 point road favorite with the over-under at 225.5. Magic coming into this matchup 31-25. and 25. Detroit 8-47. and 47. Head to head the Magic 3-0 in the last three head to head meetings. 3-0 covering the spread in those as well. Uh, Orlando on a two game winning streak coming off a, a big Cavs win. Detroit on a four game losing streak coming off a bad Pacers loss. They lost to the Magic in their last meeting by 12 points. Uh, the Magic 5 and 1 covering on the road. 4 and 1 against Detroit. 9 and 2 covering the spread. Yeah, Magic been playing very good here. And um, yeah, won by double digits last time. Playing pretty well. 4 and 1 in their last five, coming off some good wins. They're going to have to roll with the Magic minus 7.5 and money line on the road. Next matchup, we got the Boston Celtics versus the New York Knicks. Boston opening up as a seven point road favorite with the over under at 224.5. Celtics coming into this matchup 44 and 12. The Knicks 34 and 22. Head to head Boston 6 and 4 in the last 10 head to head meetings. Uh, Boston uh, 9 and 1 in their last 10. They're on a 7 game win streak right now. Uh, they're playing great. Coming off a big Chicago win. Knicks coming off a big Philly win. Uh, ending their four-game losing streak they were on. Still, the injuries, you know, no Julius Randle, no OG Anubi, so that definitely hurts the rotation. They're not the same without them, obviously. Boston, 12-6 and six on the road against the Knicks. 5-0 and oh on the road right now, so they're on a nice road stretch where they've been very good. Knicks just 1-6 and six covering in their last seven games. Haven't been able to cover the spread, really. I like Boston. I just think they're too much for this Knicks team. Because if it was fully healthy, it'd be a different story here. But yeah, I think I got gotta gotta roll with the Celtics minus seven and money line on the road. Then the last matchup, we got the Brooklyn Nets versus the Minnesota Timberwolves. Minnesota opening up as a seven and a half point home favorite with the over under at two eighteen. Nets coming into this matchup twenty one and thirty four. Minnesota thirty nine and seventeen. Head to head, Minnesota six and four in the last ten head to head meetings. Uh, Brooklyn three and seven in their last ten. They're on a three game losing streak, coming off a Toronto, a bad Toronto. They're coming off back to back blowout losses. Um, Minnesota coming off a tough five point minutes or Bucks loss last night. Uh, so they'll be on a back to back. We'll see if they're resting anybody. Uh, Brooklyn three and nine covering against Minnesota. 2-13 and 13 covering on the road. They've been horrible on the road pretty much this season. I went Minnesota 12-5 and five at home where they play well. You know, 4-1 and one in their last five. 4-1 and one covering the spread. So, you know, tough Bucks game yesterday. I expect them to bounce back. Um, I really don't think they should be resting anybody. It's the second half of the season. You know, they're trying to make the playoffs and get a good seed. So uh, I expect a nice win for the Minnesota at home. I'm going to bounce back. Give me Minnesota minus 7.5 and, and money line at home. That's going to be it for the video. Good luck with your picks and parlays on Saturday. Hope you guys all cash out, and I'll see you guys Sunday. Have a good one.